I felt inspired right away to go ahead and give you the number one dating hack that you probably never heard before, especially if you're a man and you're going to be extremely surprised if you're a woman. I'm going to say this quick, I'm going to say this powerfully, and I'm going to do my best to stay direct. It's Pernell Bobby checking in. Go ahead, hit the subscribe now to get your dating, romance, and sexuality information coming in the form of spirituality and how I use astrology to make all that happen. Here's the number one benefit. Here's the number one thing you need to know. Here is the, mm. and it's primarily for men. Men, this is what you need to know about women. If a woman does not open her heart for you, recognize that it is a direct inhibitor to you opening your heart after your wounds for her. Now, men, you have this macho, this egoic mentality that and I count myself in this very well included. I've had for the longest time this macho, this egoic leader mentality where leader meant I'm leading. But we know that the women are. And when we get out of the way of the woman by actually also understanding what does it look like for a woman to have her heart open and recognize that the more her rose opens, her flower, that vagina, quite frankly, which is also a sacred temple all right when it opens like a flower that blossoms at its own time at its own space then she gives you the world then she gives you a home she gives you a family she gives you an empire she gives you the kingdom you so desire everything that you can possibly put on your wish list as a man to have the perfect woman it starts from you being the perfect person to slowly allow and understand how her particular flower blossoms and don't try to force your way in there. There's so many things that ruin this culture. Rape, violations of physical power over a woman. The list, quite frankly, goes on. But it's also time to stop allowing that narrative to be your identity. I need you to detach from that as your identity. And recognize that it's going to cause you an ego death. And it's going to hurt. And your spirit's going to tug this way. And you're going to tug this way. And my spirit was tugging this way. My spirit was tugging that way. And I was like, walk out the door, P. Just allow the fear of intimacy. Allow the bottle of racial discrimination to just bottle you in. Allow it to do that. And I say this as a black man dating a German woman. A black American man dating a German woman. You think that there's not unconscious triggers and battles that go on from a cultural perspective that we don't even have any understanding about? But here's the beauty about this. This is why this dating romance and sexuality tips I'm going to be putting out for you and the reason you need to subscribe is so critical. When a woman opens her heart by you also allowing that heart to blossom at her own pace and to start learning how to step down from this macho man false narrative and recognize that the queen is the one leading the pack and if you allow her to do that she will allow you the space to do you the number one thing you want as a man is to do you so this is the number one hack right here this is the number one dating tip that you need to get the life that you deserve ladies and gentlemen but this is especially for gentlemen and for women listening give yourself the space to open up your heart too and recognize that whatever you do up front he has the ability to do behind because you know what this is the reality men are growing up insecure and women obviously want a strong man they need to start saying this more but they need to give them the space to be a strong man and my lady taught me that so make sure you check out her channel right here. I'm going to drop it up. And what I'm going to say about her channel is you're really going to be diving into the Ayurvedic healing practices, helping you to get back in touch with your body like many men of are, like many women are. Quite frankly, Western culture is because we really suck at things called mindfulness and sitting the fuck down and shutting the fuck up and really beyond the surface meaning, understand that you don't know shit. This is the number one dating hack. This is the number one romance and sexuality tip. Our hot and heavy podcast where we talk about this stuff regularly has just dropped. Check the link down below. I'm going to drop that for you. We just dropped the first episode today about our twin flame relationship and how that dynamic came in to now give us union from a place of separation. This is the other half of my soul and I absolutely love her. And it's amazing to love a woman and sit there and scream it out loud and admit that feeling. It's amazing. You really want to be a man? Well, fucking man up and do your job and provide safety and security for her. Give her the blanket for her chaos. But don't forget to give yourself space too. This does not mean sit there, bend over, take it in the ass. 
And if you like that, I'm, just, I'm down for it too. Let's do it. Let's roll with it. To be straight up. Take the judgments away. Look at reality. And recognize it's the number one dating tip. It's the number one hack in the dating space. It's the number one tip that you need to really get a woman to open up your heart. If you're looking to attract a soulmate. If you want a real one. If you don't want a real one and you're still playing games, turn this video off now. For the rest of you, subscribe if you rock with this. It's Pernell Bobby checking in. I'm going to be dipping the astrology in this too and showing that to you how it makes sense. But join that hot and heavy podcast. Love.